Hello, welcome to my next video. Um, this time I wanted to show you um, what I've uh, done with uh, the armor of this marine. Uh, so we can, as you can see, I uh, took the time and uh, um, painted uh, a little more of his armor. Uh, I uh, added more contrast. So you can see the, this, those places that uh, were when uh, where you you uh, seen the uh, sketch uh, are brighter. Uh, so I've widened uh, the highlight uh, because uh, when we made the sketch, as you can see on his leg, uh, those are were only small places that were uh, sketched and highlighted. Uh, so if you want the uh, element to be um, of a brighter blue blue color. We should uh, widen all the mid-tones, uh, so uh, the surface will have the uh, brighter color. So you can see um, on his uh, um, chest here, I've widened uh, the place where uh, the highlight was um, to uh, next, this extent, and also on the helmet. Uh, so we can see it here. Uh, so it's a bigger uh, place uh, that uh, the mid-tone is occupying. Uh, and also on his leg and uh, um, feet. Uh, the next next thing is that um, uh, when we uh, made the sketch, uh, we jumped uh, through different colors. Uh, so um, I used all the uh, colors that we haven't used to smoothen it out, to um, add uh, more texture. Some I added some uh, small streaks, as you can see here, maybe here on his armor, in those places. So it looks uh, shiny but uh, worn. Uh, it's not. Uh, I didn't want it, uh, the, the armor to look uh, like it's uh, completely new, polished, and uh, not uh, worn in battle. <coughs> so. Uh, going uh, with the method methodology of the sketch that I uh, showed you earlier, you can see that uh, we still have uh, the line of the highlight. So uh, the start is here on his helmet, and then it goes through the chest piece here, uh, through the groin armor, and uh, through the leg. Yeah. And if you would see from the side, you know, we only have the sketch. So here I should finish the, it uh, on a, at a later, later date. Uh, also, I added secondary reflections. Uh, so this is an example. So it's something small uh, that may be something that is reflected from the ground. Maybe this reflection on this uh, uh, plate will uh, bounce uh, the light a little uh, on uh, his chest piece and also here you can see uh, here uh, the light is bouncing from the golden eagle on his uh, uh, on this piece of armor so um, you can see that the, this uh, the bounce and the, um, the light is reflected its uh, reflection uh, is visible but it's uh, not so strong as the main uh, highlight here so it's only a dispersed light that is visible on this place. But uh, I add such things because uh, um, if we would leave this whole surface in the shadow, it would only be very dark and not interesting. But we want to add small details. And the same example is uh, on his uh, leg here. And the light is bouncing from this point and is reflected on this part of the armor. Uh, so you can see adding such uh, such small details fills the miniature and adds uh, more detail. But uh, as you can see that uh, we only painted the the front and this it's only the sketch on the front and if we would uh, finish the, his this this leg also his his arms the armor would look finished uh, from the front. Uh, we can of course add uh, secondary reflections uh, to even depthen the, uh, the effect of uh, reflective, uh, a reflective armor, but it's not needed. Uh, if you want a faster effect, you can only make the sketch and then uh, smoothen it out, add maybe some small details. Um, also, <coughs> you can see that uh, I wanted the uh, upper part of the armor to be brighter. 
So here I used uh, pure white to highlight here and uh, going uh, lower I used uh, I didn't use white I used only bright blue just to build the uh, overall uh, light and shadow uh, and uh, the overall overall volume on the whole miniature. <coughs> so um, you can see as an example uh, how it's it's finished. And uh, here, yeah, we, we must finish this this leg. We must finish his arms and the whole back. <coughs> so you can see on the back it's only the sketch. So rotating the miniature, we will see a difference how it can be uh, finished. And all the blends were done by the same technique that I showed you on the plate uh, and uh, earlier on the chest piece. It's only thin glazes uh, with a thin brush. <coughs>